All right, hey everybody. Uh, today we're going to be walking through setting up our M-Track 2X2 series audio interface for the first time. Uh, so we'll probably stop at a few places where uh, you might get stuck or talk about some of the features on the product itself as we go. I'll be using the 2X2M uh, in this example. So once you open up your 2X2, you'll notice there's a number of different cards in there. Uh, the first one we'll be talking about is this one right here, and we will go and get the driver for the 2X2M. So let's go. So mAudio.com forward slash drivers. And here you'll choose audio, uh, USB audio and MIDI interfaces. You'll find the two, your product, the 2X2 or 2X2M in this case. Um, if you choose, if you have a Mac, you'll notice that uh, it is class compliant, so no drivers are necessary. Uh, I'll be using a, uh, as you can see, it's class compliant right there. I'm using a Windows 10 computer, uh, and for Windows there is uh, a driver available. Basically, uh, Mac and Mac and Windows they're so similar during this process. The only difference is the driver installation, which is the reason why I'm using a Windows computer, so you guys can see this. Um, but basically the process to to set the unit up to install the software to open up cubase once we actually install it it's all basically the same you know a couple of different screenshots and and uh and installation shots as you go along but basically just press next continue forward and you'll get it all set up so this video will walk through the process on a windows computer uh but on a mac it's very similar so i'm choosing the windows 10 64-bit driver and uh downloading it right here once you get to this page, choose download now. Now that it's downloaded, I'm going to click on this, open it up, and install the driver. I accept the terms of the license agreement. All right, and now you're going to press install, uh, let it finish doing its thing, choose finish, and there we go. The driver is now installed. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to put them in the comments section below. And until next time, thanks for watching.